Well, today is the start of the official end of the year holiday travel period. That according to TSA, with millions expected to take to the skies and the roads, what kind of delays can travelers expect? Yeah, Amarachi Uche spoke with Pitt Greenville Airport's executive director and some travelers on ways they're preparing for the busy travel season. She's live now in studio with more. Amarachi. Yeah, Dave Courtney, when speaking with people today about their travel plans, the advice you'll often hear is to arrive early, be prepared, and pack your patience. Yeah, I checked, double checked, uh, made sure I had my tickets um, scheduled. I uh, paid for them last night so I can get here. Timmy Williams arrived at Pitt Greenville Airport with six hours to spare, wanting to take no chances of missing his flight to Texas to surprise his son, who was in the military, for the holidays. While his situation might be a bit on the extreme side, the TSA is expecting security checkpoints to be busier this year compared to last year. If you're coming through a smaller airport, Pitt Greenville Airport's executive director, Bill Hopper, says it may feel like a breeze. You know, we, we, we have 50 passenger aircraft, so you don't have to worry about the crowds here, uh, even during the holidays. But the other end, uh, you know, when you try to return, uh, you're going to want to have plenty of time and bring your patients with you. But Hopper suggests leaving enough time for the unexpected. A lot of airlines uh, shut off, you know, uh, check-in and baggage check an hour prior to a flight. And so you want to make sure that you're going to go out and enjoy that, that vacation and during the holidays. As for drivers, AAA expects nearly 104 million drivers, making it the second highest number on record. Michael Hess says he hopes to beat the 5 o'clock traffic as he heads back home to Wilmington, but is worried he might face some obstacles. Sometimes there's accidents. I hope there's not because that usually does prohibit the distance, but um, it's mainly just the single lane roads back home is what I'm worried about. As for Williams, he decided six hours in Greenville's airport was a bit much, so he headed home to kill some time before his flight. AAA also says December 23rd and 28th will be the most congested days on the road, so leave before 10 a.m. to make sure your holidays are a little less stressful. Wishing everyone safe travels. I'm Rachi Uche, WITN News. Dave Courtney. All right, always good to leave extra time. Thanks, Amarachi. And TSA says the busiest days are projected to be today, December 29th and January 1st, where they expect to screen more than 2.5 million people each day.